Kyra, I'm near the GRE lab. Pilgrim, you better wait until night time. It's probably swarming with infected during the day. Where do I look for the bodies? You'll learn everything from the recording. I can't listen to it. Over and out. Little Rhonda base. The exit downstairs is jammed, so we're gonna try and find a way out at the top. Sierra and I found Private Kitty in the lobby on the lowest level. Oh, oh, watch that stink. Kitty, did you just far? Is that how happy you are to see us? What? No, I didn't. <laughs> we missed you, punk. Did you hear that? We better get our asses out of here. Admit it, Sierra. You're the one who farted and tried to blame me.
Sorry, I gotta take this. Tough son of a gun, weren't you?
ask for a favor? Can't imagine this thing. Gonna tell you something. <laughs> Just you've Kara. So, have you found any dog tags yet? I found the dog tags of Sierra, Little Ron, and Kitty. Thank you, Pilgrim. This is for you. Do you have the other dog tags? Did Sierra and Little Ron know there were screamers in this lab? Sierra certainly assumed that possibility. He wasn't stupid. I remember how we laughed at Sierra. We used to call him Brains. He kept getting job offers from the top. But he never cared for climbing the ladder. He preferred to stick close to his brother, Braska. As for little Ron, he joined the PK after having lost his son. Who knows? Maybe he went back for Kitty because he reminded him of his boy. I'm still looking.
Carriers Guild. Thank you. Wait a moment, won't you please? Is someone at the door, Giselle? No, Mother. I was just locking it. Thank you for the letter. It's from my love, Keld. He lives on the other side of the city. We belong together. But my parents forbid it. Ah, uh, yeah. Seems like a local fashion these days. But uh, I'm not sure what I can do for you. For one, you can just listen. I have no one else to talk to. Okay. And you can have this letter delivered. If he could afford to leave his family, we would be together. But he can't. So I'll go to him. The letter says where he should meet me. Okay. I'll take this back to the guild. What are you ranting about, mister? Ranting? Son, I'm trying to safeguard our collective memory. I'm only trying to preserve history. Seems like a big task. Can one man even do that? I have a good background for that. For 30 years, I was a tourist guide. After the fall, I founded Villador's Historical Conservation Society. It doesn't seem to be much to conserve around here anymore. Thank the renegades for that. Still, more than ever, we must remember our past. We must keep track. Otherwise, we'll slip into the Dark Ages for good. We can't build a future for humankind if we don't know our history. What do you say I ask you two or three questions about that? See if you've been paying attention. See if you do know our past. So, you ready to talk history now? I can try. Good. Let's start with one of the defining moments of our history. A tragic event that had such an impact, it still defines how the city looks today. Here goes. What event went down in history as Black Monday? It's a mass shooting that happened in Hounfield on March 6, 2024. Wrong. You should listen more to people and their stories. It shouldn't be hard. Everybody here lost somebody during Black Monday. I'll try to do better next time. Not so fast. History is for the patient. Learn more and come back later. Mail for you, sir. Thanks. About time. Been quiet around here lately. Oh, honey, I, I could have gotten that. Stop that, Tanya. Don't you treat me like I'm useless, too. I, I didn't mean that. I, just, I just remember, I only lost a leg. I didn't become one of those things. N no. No. But, um... Well, um, who, who's the letter from? HQ. And I can tell you what it says before I open it. Yep. <laughs> I've been booted. No longer fit for duty. No, oh, honey. Oh, shut up. I don't need your pity. What I need is something to fucking do. Right now, I'm just a lame horse waiting to be shot. Well, maybe just 
Give it some time, honey. There's plenty someone in your condition can... What did I just say? None of your fucking pity. I may have lost my leg, but I can still chase you down. I still got two hands to slap you with. So shut your fucking mouth! What you feeling? Amazing design. No need to be a stranger. Can't let Finding darkness and ignorance reign. And still no so, you ready to talk history now? I can try. Good. A tragic event. What event went down in history as Black Monday? The first outbreak of the virus in the city. Wrong. You should listen more to people. I'll try to do better next. <coughs> so, you ready to... T I can try. Good. A tra... What event... That would be the chemical strikes on the city 11 years ago. Correct. On January 6th, 2025, at 0800 hours, the butcher, Colonel Williams, decided to use a newly discovered chemical compound, the THV Gen Mod, to stop infection. Hope of reclaiming control of the city turned to tragedy. Millions of residents were killed. It also caused terrifying mutations of the infected, turning them into what we now call specials. The chemicals are still active today. Don't get near them. I mentioned the March Massacre before. Any clue what happened on this day? The army killed 64 civilians protesting against weapons confiscation. You actually have been paying attention. This is correct. This shooting was the beginning of escalation of riots in the city, which finally led to the fall of General Pratt and Colonel Williams taking over. The army confiscated all the guns and ammo. It all started there, south of Houndfield, by the monument of the World Art Congress. The last question. Let's go for a moment out of Villador, taking a global perspective. Before mutating, THV was simply known as Haran virus. Haran is where it all started. But do you remember when the Haran events happened? March, uh, 2020. You were close. But no, you still have a lot to learn. Farewell, Pilgrim. So, you ready to... I can... Tr Good. A tragic event that... Ha what event? That would be... Cur hope at all the chemic... I'm... The army... You... This, the arm, the lap before mutating. But do you remember? It's fall 2016. You were cloaked. So, you. Good. Uh, what? Cur hope at all. The chem. I'm. The arm. You. This, the arm, the lap before. But. In early spring 2014. 
Bravo! I'm impressed, young man. Indeed. The virus emerged during Haran's Global Athletic Games in 2014 and went dormant after the city was quarantined. It was subsequently turned into an exclusion zone by the GRE. I remember those would-be games. I even took a week off to watch them. My country had many metal prospects. No one expected it would become hell on Earth. But that's the part everyone knows and never talks about, since it's what caused the fall. I commend you on your knowledge, young man. Never stop seeking more. And never forget, we're always just a few burning history books away from darkness. Here's a small token of my appreciation. Should teach you a bit about one of my favorite parts of the city. The catacombs. Shot. How deliveries go? Uh, the usual. I was given a letter. I'll make sure that's processed. Thanks, Professor. Bloody hell, you're just scrambling up the ladder here. A few more rungs and you're gonna get promoted again. How's it hanging? I've got no deliveries. It's like people forgot how to write all of a sudden. Harmless eccentric. Turns out he was a night runner and he has a daughter. Come <laughs> on. 
close to the gym, Kyra. Any idea where to find Bardas's body? Bartes is bound to have fallen near a swarm of slain enemies. Anyway, listen for yourself. Don't you find it strange that a group of Bazarians wants to hand us over an injured PK in a place like this? Take it easy, Auntie.
with that many myself. Respect. to corrode. Sure are a lot of ads. What kind? You're saying that. there must be a lot of You pretend. Hey, Kyra. Did you find anything else? I've been running around a little, but here it is. Bartez's dog tag. Thank you on behalf of her husband. You deserve something. Do you have the other dog tags? Bartez saved Chris's life without hesitating. Yes. Chris owed her extra time in this world. Bartez was one of many women in our ranks, but one of the few that could kill a dozen infected all by herself. That's all for now. <laughs> 